morning guys, YouTube people. Alright, uh, got some projects going on. Um, woke up, decided to start messing with the Audi, and I was like, I'm just going to push it back and see what I got to do. And I already cleaned it up, but there was a oil spot right there. So, you guys know me and who I'm down with. As you can see, took everything apart. I don't know if you guys can see down there. Focus. Got a lot of oil. So I'm thinking the oil filter housing is leaking. Um, I see a little bit of a wet spot right down there. Um, and then I see a lot of wet spot down there. So I can get better access to all this down here now. Um, <clears throat> I didn't want to bore you guys with all the stupid video of tearing it all apart. But it was a pain in the butt. Pain in the butt. So, start off with, take off the intake tube that comes throttle body or throttle valve. Intake. Intake bolts were a pain in the butt. Get yourself a little quarter inch ratchet. Quarter inch drive ratchet. And I don't remember what size T that is. Uh, T30. T30 is pretty much the standard bolt on this I found and you just got to start disconnecting wires after wires after wires. Hoses be very careful because this is plastic. These are lines, vacuum lines are all plastic and they'll break. So I got all the wiring, all the little things. Hopefully I didn't break that, whatever the heck that is. I'm assuming it's another glow plug because this engine has a little baby glow plugs right down there you got three on this side and three on that side they're all numbered I don't remember what number it was I don't really care the wires can only go it's such tight wiring it can only go a certain spot so this side's really easy this one's longer that one's a special weird stupid connector this and then the other connectors are I don't even know. I don't. I don't be remember, nor do I want to remember. I don't know. I got wires everywhere on this stupid thing. Here's one right here. They're numbered. So it's this. Just looks like a little baby spark plug wire. That one says six. So wherever six goes is where it goes. Um, a lot of stuff. So. Basically, I want to get to my problem, probably why it started leaking coolant, is because it probably got hot. So I'm going to show you. You guys want to add some horsepower to your TDI? Let's go look. You guys won't even believe me if I showed you. So it's windy outside. I was going to do some stuff outside, but I don't do stuff when it's windy. You can see it's windy. All right, ready to unlock a million horse or uh, you probably unlock about a hundred 150 foot pounds of torque doing this look at that look at that thank you EP stupid a man that's all from all right so this memory card got full I always forget to delete stuff but anyway this is the uh, throttle body, throttle valve, whatever you want to call it. EGR comes up through this. So this sits um, on the intake. Let's just line it up. This sits there. Then this sits on that piece right here. So if you see, not dirty. I mean, a little, little oily. Which means I probably got a seal bad in my turbo. But once you get into this, where the EGR crap comes in, look at that stuff. <sighs> so this is going to make throttle response a hundred times better. 
because I'm going to clean it. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to take all these seals out, set all the seals aside, and then I'll probably, obviously, I'll take the electronics off. Um, this, um, I don't know if I can take the electronic off of this. I might just soak it, you know, at this level in some stuff. But man, that's, that's huge. It's massive air loss you're losing. You know, and that's, it's, it's not like it's bad fuel I'm using. It's, I'm not running a tuner. I'm not doing anything. I drive the car to get miles per gallon. I don't load the car up. Um, granted, I did buy the car used. So, who knows if that's old or new. But anyway, yeah, so looks like the car is going to be down for probably a week because I have the parts to fix the coolant leak. I don't have the part to fix that, whatever it is, this oil leak. Um, but anyway, yeah, so I'm going to take it all apart. It's, pain, it's a, It was a pain in the butt. It's back breaking. Um, one of the bolts into the intake goes like right in here and you can't get to it it's a pain in the butt um, I ended up getting to it but I ended up using the allen wrench if you have real skinny Torx tools which I might go pick up today I might just go pick up some Torx like allens you know I don't know if it makes sense but they're basically these things right here this has got Torx on it so I might go pick up some of those at the Harbor Freight today. Um, but anyway, I'm going to get to it. I can't really film and do all this because like, I'm laying up on the car like all the way up back in here. I probably won't be doing that anymore, laying it there. But I got parts laid out. So as you can see, this is the boost tube. Um, no crap in it. Um, you have to take a fuel line off. The intake, I'm going to clean this mass airflow sensor because I watched a lot of videos where they say that if you clean that mass airflow sensor, it increases throttle response a lot better. Anyway, I'm going to take this all off and uh, yeah, I just wanted to show you guys. You guys want to free up some power. The, the whole front in here, the intake, this uh, boost tube in here and... Uh, Whatever that's easy to take off so you can clean that and the throttle body. That's really easy to take off um, You do have this hose that comes off the EGR cooler obviously and goes up It's just a V band and you got like two screws down here But anyway, um, I just want to show you guys you guys want to free up some power in your TDI your Audi your Volkswagen your Touareg your Tiguan your Q5, Q7, A6, A8, whatever has the 3 liter diesel or even the older diesels, the 4 point whatever liter diesel. Um, take take the intake manifold off and clean that junk. Um, yeah, it's really bad. You'll I'll, I will do a video showing results like driving it and I'll just give you my opinion. Um, I won't be able to show you any stats, I guess. Like can't really tell you it'll all just be verbal but anyway you guys understand so anyway i'm gonna get to it do some more junk and uh hopefully tear it all apart see what parts i need go in the house order all the parts upload this video and uh you guys got any questions comments i will title this video like most important thing or something i don't know what i'm gonna do but all right guys see you guys on the next video um Maybe I'll show you more parts, whatever else I find, obviously. I just wanted to do this video, so see you in the next video. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing. Keep doing what you guys do. Later.